All right, this will be his first test under combat conditions. Okay, I don't like sight yet. Uh, meanwhile, ah, oh, Matrix door control. Well, there's other things as well. I wonder what. See what's over here. Server records. All right. You with me, Nick? Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Medic. Killer. Ooh, Shit out of this thing. Oh, <laughs> killed him in one. Nice. Uh oh, he's charging something. Oh, I can do this killer thing every turn? Awesome. Dope. Huh. Oh. oh. The server records. So what will these do? Hacked. Private records data store. I don't know. I'll have to take a look at them later. Kind of weird that they'd connect this computer in the public area to allow to uh, the network. Okay. Ooh, 24 damage. An excellent inaugural effort. I notice I still have 2 AP. 2, two AP. I wonder if I've reached the point where uh, I get 3 per turn. I don't know. Maybe. Did you upgrade your quickness? I can't remember. It, I don't think it's about quickness. I think it might be total amount of karma you have. Oh. I don't think it's quickness. Oh. Got him! Oh, another crit. Down he goes. Like that's matrix door control. I wonder if we can, if if we can, if. I wonder what's behind this door. I don't know. Dead. All right. Onward to matrix door control. Oh, wait, something here, too. Or did... Oh, no, that's, no, that's my yeah. entry point. Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, yeah. Although there was... Wait, there was that ice that, like, went past me through the Stargate, wasn't there? Maybe yeah, I think so. So maybe you killed it already. Maybe I have to kill that thing, because it's, it's not letting me use the, uh... The controls there. Okay, yeah. Maybe like since it's tied like it's tied to that room it has this one still has to be killed before I can That's a, yeah. that's the end of you. 
All right. Meanwhile, the nearby intercom speaker crackles to life. The voice of Dr. Holmes begins to blare from it. Attention all personnel, we have a dangerous patient loose inside the facility. Subject is a male human, but may be coordinating with other violent offenders. Use all necessary force. And if you could stop mocking my bow tie, that would be appreciated. <laughs> I don't think I could seriously work with somebody who had a bow tie. Not because I have a it problem with it, but because I would be mocking it. Your anti bow tie prejudice has been is notorious, Nick. Yes. Oh, okay, yeah, see there, now I can now I can hit it. Nice. Hacked! Bathroom door lock. I don't know, I'm not sure how useful that will be. But, okay. Now... Um, no? So we're about to find out. Oh, there's something I can take. And an alternate route. I didn't pick up. Oh, can someone left a concussion grenade in the bathroom? What the hell? Nice. Are those lockers maybe, at the end? Oh, oh yeah. There's something. There's something in that locker, actually. Yeah. Maybe concussion grenade is just like future slang for shit. <laughs> Whoa! Check out that huge guy. Wonder what his deal is. Yeah. Did they mention something about like the doctor being accompanied by like a giant troll or something? With like cyberware. Oh yeah, I think we might have. So, let me tell you, nothing creepier Probably than a hospital. A... Sorry, what's that? Go ahead. Nothing creepier than a hospital after hours with no one there. Yeah. I've, I've, I've been in that situation. With basic med kit. Well, that makes you gonna sense. Have to wrap, you gonna have to wrap it up? Yeah, probably. Pretty soon oh. here. Get this character from the screen. All right. Onward and upwards. Okay. Mental hospitals get a bad rap in video games. What? Oh, hold on, something. We got another uh, thing. All right. All right. <clears throat> as you venture deeper into the asylum, you see that the inside is every bit as bad as the outside. Gone is any attempt to uphold sanitary hospital aesthetics. With peeling paint, cracked floors, and exposed conduit, the pretense of mental care is shattered. In this modern in this modern era, men. Mercy Mental Hospital is a throwback to the barbaric asylums of old. Prisons and torture chambers rather than places of healing. It's clear that Dr. Holmes is spending his money on something other than this facility. You continue on. Doc Holmes can only run so far. Oh yeah, there's just like, like plastic tarp- oh! Who opened the cells? They'll kill us all! Did I open the cells? Did they open the cells? I don't know. I don't think you did. I don't think I did. Unless that was when I accidentally hacked or something. I don't know. When you hacked the door control. Oh, well. Well, it's too late to worry about now. That's not your problem. It is not, sir. All right. Flying robot guy? Activate! Alright. 
I'd like to call him HK-47. But... It's not a bad one. He didn't fly. No, that's true. And he doesn't have the iconic status of Johnny Five. Yeah. I know basically nothing about the... I, I said before, I know pretty much nothing about those movies. Oh! Star Wars? Point blank range. What's that? Star Wars? <laughs> no, Short Circuit! Oh. No, I have in fact seen Star Wars in its entirety. Okay. Believe it or not, at some point or another. All six? Yes, all six. <laughs> Which one's your favorite? Of all of them? Uh, I, I think the original, actually. Four? Yeah. Huh. I know I know most people say uh, Empire Strikes Back. Yeah. But I prefer the original. Oh, down he goes. Another critical hit. Nice. Shannon Half Sky. Cast haste on. I guess on Flandry. Ah. You thought my turn was done, you poor fool. <laughs> Your suffering has only begun. That dude looks like a vampire. He does kinda. There are there are vampires in the Shadowrun universe. Hmm. Although it's actually a, uh, a, a uh, like a disease. Oh. Is, that... uh, is there lycanthropy? I believe so. Yeah. Okay. Well, I told you like part of the premise of Shadowrun is like the world goes through these like cycles of like greater and lo lesser magic power. Right. And so part of it is that, like, sort of, like, a lot of, like, l one of the ideas is, like, a lot of, like, legends and such, like, that and mythology is sort of based on, like, like, sort of, like, garbled, like, garbled memories of, like, earlier, of, like, higher, of higher magic parts of the cycle. Mm. Or, like, occasionally, like, even in the lower magic parts of the cycle, there might be enough for, like, you know, one or two to appear. Right. <laughs> Alrighty. Yeah! Nice. Well, let me check my notes. Sorry. Um... Yeah, um, uh, vampires and ghouls and, like, basically stuff, uh, you know, like, what we would consider, like, the undead, um, derive from different strains of, uh, something co of what's called the human metahuman vampiric virus. Right. HMHVV. Okay. Which is a, uh, it's a retrovirus that, you know, you know, affects your DNA, and it only manifests in like high, in like high in magic high magic environments basically, which is why prior to the you know the the, the beginning of the sixth world, like it, you know it wasn't you know going around. Oh, uh, okay. And actually, that thing about uh oh, the intercom begins speaking as soon as you approach. Holmes must be watching from somewhere. You don't understand, do you? This is a place for broken things. But only by further breaking them can they be remade. And so we must break you. Uh, That's somewhat worrisome. <laughs> yeah. It's not a unheard of philosophy, though. What's that? That you have to break things to fix them. Just like Ivan Drago. Yep. I must break you. <laughs> Alrighty. Onward. And 
Well, I'm done. Okay. 